The pastries brought in from uh, Utica Bread. How about that for incredible? Uh, I don't know. This sound familiar to you? Listen carefully. And and just listen. You'll know it. You know what that is, Christine? Mm-hmm. Uh, it's actually a song. I didn't know that uh, the I'm Loving It jingle mm-hmm. was a song, which is just in just the Timberlake, but it's out. Do you want to know what it really sounds like? Okay. Well, that is where the jingle came from, so we're told. Um, I don't know. It was in my, my stuff here this morning. Yeah, you're loving it. Sad story uh, yesterday. Did you see two government, uh, two military planes went down yesterday? Yeah. Um, uh, and one of them was the... Uh, it was a Blue Angels crash in uh, Smyrna, Tennessee, and that one resulted in the death of the pilot. Hunter Hayes was supposed to ride with the Blue Angels at an air show yesterday in Tennessee, but tragically one of the pilots ended up crashing and died in a practice session beforehand. His name was Captain Jeff Coos. Mm-hmm. As it goes down, that's hard to listen to. Mm-hmm. The other one was um, uh, was the pilot ejected. I believe Two planes went down. Was it two? Uh, there was one in one location and one in the other, but in in this uh, other one, the the pilot was able to eject. So, but and, uh, the Blue Angels pilot did not. And there was also the um, the Texas floodwaters taking over the military vehicle, and five soldiers died. Yeah, and have it's they all found stateside. it's all this? All of this went on yesterday. It's mm-hmm. really really terrible. Um, uh, news anchors, uh, weather reporter in New Zealand put up a photo of a funnel cloud the other day and talked about how it looked like um, male genitalia. I don't know what is going on with these weather guys getting themselves in, uh, in, in trouble with, with uh, what would normally Pictures. be common sense. I mean, right? Do you need to go down that road? Uh, apparently, they did. Um, uh, I guess I'm not going to play it. But here is earlier we talked about the reporter uh, that uh, reported on the story of the middle school teacher in Alabama in trouble because she gave an offensive math test to her students right before she was supposed to retire. All the questions were about pimps and gang members, and the update that we have on that is that Manaski says it came out of a uh, out of a Facebook post, which was being circulated around, and um, that's probably where the teacher got it. At what point do you uh, at what point do you realize maybe that's not a good idea? Yeah, you have to. She was just close to retirement and now she's in trouble. Yeah, you have to use some type of judgment as the teacher for crying out loud. Uh, is this who I think it is? I can't read uh, it, up I'm at the sorry. Top. Yeah, that this is our man Stefan. All right. Yesterday Stefan in the um, in the Observer Dispatch had an editorial and it was about the hospital, right? Stefan downtown? Uh no, uh it's Apparently I didn't at- read it. I'm at home here. No, and, no, no, no. Uh, the editorial that the editorial was about the hospital. Yes, yeah. and I was actually at Wednesday's Common Council meeting down at uh, City Hall on Wednesday, and Scott Perra was the uh, special guest of the hospital, and he Did and you... he and he said that we are in year one of a six-year plan. He said. He says there are a lot of questions to be answered and a lot of a lot of homework to do. Yeah. And uh, he and he he says he says he doesn't know yet what uh, what might happen. He says he says they're in the beginning stages, and he said it's very badly needed. Uh, Saint Eve's next year is going to be a hundred years old. Yeah, I think we're, we're to the point where we do realize that the new hospitals are are needed. And now uh, your whole thing is that there should be, and re- really, you're saying what the Observer Dispatch is saying, and that is that there should be a great deal of transparency in the process, right? Yeah, yeah. No, we yeah. need to have public hearings. And well, you were at one of them, right? You were there for it. Did you ask any questions? There were questions yeah. and uh, and uh, go- the government official questions, and uh, we need to have our homework done before ground is broke. All right, all right, Stefan. Well, nice job. Good, uh, very nice editorial. I think it was uh, it was quite proper yesterday. It was a nice job. Thank you, Bill. All right, uh, got a break, Christine, with an update. Here is uh, Christine Bellino. Good morning, Christine.